Casey Burke here, and it's a Monday, so it's time for a grocery wheel. Today is Monday, the day, the, mo the Monday before Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving came and passed for you guys, but not for us. Well, not yet, not in this timeline. Um, it's the 25th of November, and it's almost like it. <sighs> Thanksgiving came late this month because I'm getting, you know how you get notifications like this happened last year? I already had my Christmas stuff up. It was like, it was, Thanksgiving was done. So Thanksgiving came late this year. But anyway, I got busy doing my laundry deliveries. And for some reason, I have this wild hair to make a vegetarian Thanksgiving feast. <laughs> Just for me. However, I did invite Tanya. So Tanya says she's going to stop by, so I hope so. I might invite others. I haven't decided yet, but I have invited Tanya, and Tanya Danielle said she's coming over. Now, you know that I already bought some mashed potatoes and green beans and all that kind of stuff. I kind of already started. I bought the vegan roast. But then um, I got craving it, so I made a green bean casserole already, and I made the mashed potatoes already, and I've been eating that. So I'm like, okay, I gotta go to the store. I usually go on Monday anyway. I need to. I want to add to the Thanksgiving feast because you just, it was just me. I just have to roast. I wouldn't have to, but I'm, I want to make all the sides for some reason. I don't know why. I just want to make all the sides. I want to make the the stuffing, which is hard to do because you read the stuffing mix and there there's um, chicken broth in it or there's turkey broth or turkey flavoring or something. So. I had to go through and read the instructions on certain ones to get a real vegetarian one. Then you got to get the onion to get the celery. <laughs> and then I, I just, well, you'll see what I bought. I had to go to two different stores because I went to Ralph's. Oh, my God. I thought I was going to die there. I think that's, that's hell. That's hell. There were so many people, and they're all going crazy, and they're all in the way. Like, they're just like, you know, they, they won't get out of the way. Like, the etiquette is really bad. I think it's like... When they call Sunday drivers, same with holidays, like it's amateur day. It's like people that don't get out that often, of course, it's kind of like me, but people that don't go out that often, they forget their etiquette. They forget that there's other people in the world that might need to get around them. Anyway, it was hellish. So I had to go to two different places. There's some things that are probably that was supposed to be cold. It's not cold anymore, and I hope it's still good. In fact, I'm going to go straight to it right now, put the refrigerator. I got some whipped topping. Ready right with. I'm going to put this in the freezer before it gets uh, all out the freezer, but in the freezer because I know that was been out for a while. I didn't get pie because I'm not really a pie, a sweet person. I don't, I'm not, I'm not a sweet person at all. Um, you know. And Tanya, Danielle doesn't eat sweets. So I don't know. I might get, I, I might try to find when it's not so crazy, like just a small little pumpkin pie. Just because it's one of those things. Like now that coffee upsets me, I still make coffee every morning, even though I have a couple sips and throw the rest away. It's because it's just habit. It's just comforting to do that, that that's what you do. So I'm making a Thanksgiving feast. So that whipped topping, I don't know what I'm going to do with it. Maybe I'll just put it on my coffee. But I was craving all the time. I'm like, you know what, I'm going to have it. And then if I do get pie, sometimes people bring pies. So I might get a pie. I don't know. I'm not really... If anything, I'll get like a pumpkin pie because those are good. But I don't want a whole pie to myself. So I'm going to look when it's not so crazy and try to find like if they sell like a little sliver, which I think they do. I think there's a few bakeries down the street that I could go to. All right. So since Tanya Danielle's coming over, I needed some vodka because uh, there's one little thing left. And you know how she comes, does her chat. So, um, I know this is, I don't know my vodkas. I know this is the cheap vodka, but I just grabbed it. If I want to get better vodka, I usually go to the corner uh, liquor store to this mom and pop area. And I'd rather spend my money there. And I, I hate standing in the aisle, looking at the aisle and not knowing what to get. So I just got like the cheap vodka. I hope, sorry, Tanya. Oh, by the way, I don't know how much it is. I'm going to add it up later because there's two receipts. <coughs> and I'll put this away later too. Um, I just got four bottles of champagne, my fruit, because I've been into that again lately. Now that it's summer's ended, and I, my, you know, margaritas is not the thing anymore because it's not hot on the beach. So now I'm back to my uh, mimosas, 
my Sunday mimosa, so I got some stuff for that in case also I don't have time to have champagne since he doesn't do sugar. But I have it anyway. Okay, this is from, this is all from Ralph's. Okay, Sam said I already got into the mashed potatoes. I have some left. Um, so, we have mashed potatoes, but I, I did kind of warm some up. Oh, by the way, what I'm wearing is Mary Krampus. I figured it's time to wear my Krampus shirt. So, see, I love Krampus. If you don't know who Krampus is, just Google Krampus. It's basically the Christmas demon. Santa brings toys to the naughty, or brings toys to the good kids. Krampus takes care of the naughty kids. Huh, Felix? You're fine, though. But since, I thought I would change it up. I walked by this, and I'm like, you know what? This is a good time to try it. Um, this is garlic mashed cauliflower instead of potatoes. Um, I think it would be good. Tanya's really healthy, so I don't even know how much anything was. I just grabbed it because it was, like, chaotic. Uh, nothing was on sale. Um, so I got that. Oh, yeah, I broke a nail. I broke this nail, and I went to go get it fixed. Well, I glued it, right? Went to go get it fixed, and she goes, oh, you did really good. The glue looks great. You're fine. <laughs> she didn't fix it. I go, uh, really? She goes, oh, no, it looks good. I'm like, okay, so I wasted my time going down there. And guess what? It did break. I wish she would have fixed it, but she didn't. So, it's a glitch day. It's a glitch day. Uh, just, oh, I got to put this in the I just walked by this, and I just thought this looks interesting. <laughs> Uh, this has nothing to do with Thanksgiving, but I'm a vegetarian, not, um, a vegan, so I could eat cheese. Um, but this is jalapeno and cheese tamales. Those look really good. Those look really good. Because I've been hoping that they w I would find some vegetarian, um, tamales, and that looks really good. So I'm going to put that in the freezer. I probably won't eat that for, like, ever. So, with that, I got that. I just got regular st sticks of butter. I do have regular butter, but I thought I better get sticks of butter in case I do need it to measure it, and I don't want to run out of butter. So I just got the cheap little blue bonnet. It was 89 cents. I just got cheap blue bonnet butter. Uh, then I got a can of yams because it was on sale. And I'm not, you know, I do like yams. I don't know if I'm going to use this for Thanksgiving, but it's nice to have on hand because Christmas is coming up. And I, God, this shirt's bulky. It's just so just wearing my leggings, and as I just noticed that, that it looks like I'm fat, but I've been working out, so so I'm just showing you. I'm thin. I'm thin. <laughs> so I got some yams. I don't know when I'll eat those, but I do like yams. And I'm going to make some more green bean casserole because I already made some, and I love green bean casserole. So I got more the fried onions to go on top of it. Of course, I got more green beans. I just get the no sugar at it. Normal cut green beans. And then, of course, I got cream of mushroom soup. I'm going to make my green bean casserole. I was tempted to get Brussels sprouts, but I'm like, okay, I, I can't have everything. Brussels sprouts will be later because I, I love Brussels sprouts. I've been drinking a lot of water, so I got two spring waters this time. Because that's another thing you don't want to run out. Especially, I think, you know, Tanya's coming over for Thanksgiving. She might want some water. And I know she's healthy, so she'll break, probably drink a lot of it. So I got some water. All right. And I figured, you know what? I better get some dinner rolls because I have bread. But if anyone wants bread, um, I have some dinner. I, I just got some just normal dinner rolls. I didn't know what to get. Literally, it was crazy. I just, whenever I saw an opening <laughs> for whatever I needed. Sorry, I'm not bald. My hair is just, like, really. I'm not really liking what I look like right now. But anyway. Whenever I saw an opening to get some, I just grab, grabbed it. So I just got some dinner rolls. I don't know if they're good. I just grabbed them. And then I got more uh, bathroom tissue for the guest bathroom since I did go to Ralph's. This is 77 cents, and that's the only place I could get the 77 cents bathroom tissue. So I got that. And these, I gotta check my receipt. This said this was 99 cents. And if that is the deal, that's good. Because uh, I figured I'm gonna have a lot of stuff. And if anyone wants to take some home, like maybe if Tanya might want to take some leftovers home, I thought I'll get some little Tupperware. Because um, I have my Tupperware, but, you know, I wash it, it's old, it's like, you know, some missing lids or stuff. So this way it would be just easy, breezy. And if anyone wants to take home leftovers, there's the left, there's, there it is. 
<sighs> and I like gingerbread cookies. They were sold out for gingerbread cookies. That's another reason when, when you go shopping, when everyone's buying stuff for Thanksgiving, everything's sold out that you like. But I go, I gotta have some cookies. I mean, you know, I'm not into sweets, but it's just something you like to put in a little container at the house where people come over, they have cookies. Because a lot of people do like sweets. So I want to have something sweet for after dinner in case, you know. And I might have one with coffee in the morning, who knows. But I just got the chess men. I wish they had the gingerbread. Gingerbread are my favorite. But that's okay. I got that. And it was on sale for $1.99. So, okay, here's my other green beans. Oh, a bit. Here's my green bean. My green bean casserole. And then coffee. Because I am running low. Uh, like I said, I do um, I do make it every day. But I, it kind of upsets my stomach, and I just I take a few sips of it. But I got some coffee. And then for the stuffing, when I do make it, um, it says, you know, to add bouillon, and it does, like, well, not bouillon, but broth, and it does taste good. And I don't use meat broth. I use vegetable broth. And instead of buying a container of vegetable broth, which I'm only going to use a little bit, and then the whole thing's going to go to waste, I like to buy the bouillon. I buy the vegetable bouillon. And then that way, whenever you need, like, broth, you got you just use a little cube, and then this stuff lasts forever. Last. In fact, I probably already have some. I bet I already have some in there, but oh well, there we go. Um, oh yeah, I better put this in the freezer too. Okay, that was all Ralph's. Now we're at Vaughn's because Ralph's didn't have this. And yes, I got another roast because I'm probably going to cook one for Thanksgiving, of course, and have leftovers, and everyone's going to take leftovers. But I remember this one being really good. So I wanted an extra one for Christmas. However, so Christmas, I always have an annual thing. We always go to this this divey uh, restaurant that's so old school, like you would imagine it like in the 30s or the 40s. And, um, you know, it's, you get, I don't eat steak anymore, but there's steak, you get steak, you get baked potato, you get soup, you get salad, like you get so much. It's almost like a little sizzler, but it's not a sizzler. It's like a, it's an old fashioned place. I think it's, it's called the Prospector. And um, it even has the rolled velvet seats and all, it, like it's this old school. And I usually have my annual Christmas dinner there with, with my, like, family, my family. Um, and I'll just have, like, a baked potato. But it's, it's just a tradition. So that, but Christmas Day, I might make this. Or I might just save it because this would be actually be good in a sandwich. Because I love, I used to remember loving having Thanksgiving sandwiches like leftover thanksgiving stuff and you just put it all in a sandwich because this you cut up like the roast like like this and you you can put that in a sandwich because this is basically like um you know it's imitation turkey of course you know it's probably made with soy or whatever um maybe tofu i don't know and it has like stuffing and cranberries and a wild rice um it just it looks really good so i got another roast and here's the stuffing I grabbed. I, I should have probably got the box one, but I think it's the same amount. Just the box was just like bulkier. And I looked, I read the ingredients. I didn't see any uh, meat in it. So I'm pretty sure it's good. Um, and I'm going to use the uh, vegetable broth. Um, and so I just got Petri Pepperidge Farms um, seasoned stuffing. And... I love onions and celery in it, and I, I was going to buy an onion and a celery, but then I was looking at the price, I'm like, oh, that's kind of, you know, because nothing was really on sale, only a few things, and then chopping it up, and I'm like, this was $5, and this is way more, <laughs> this is way more than I need, I don't need this much at all, but I said, screw it, <laughs> I'm just going to grab it, because it's like, I, I don't see myself chopping up the onion, I probably should have just got some onion and celery, but they... Even if I got a stock of celery, that's too much for me. Um, but I guess I could have got the celery because my birds could have it. Because my birds can't have this because it has onion in it, and onions are not good for birds. So I'm just going to use what I use, and the rest is going to have to toss out, I guess. But that's not good. But it's just onions and celery. And the last thing I got was 
marshmallows. I'm probably not going to put them on the, the sweet potatoes or the yams um, for Tanya because she doesn't like sugar, but I'll probably put them on for me because <laughs> I do like my, my sweet potatoes and yams with the marshmallows. Now, they didn't have at the store eggnog this time, but it's okay. I'm, I'm pretty stocked up. I even went to the other place, CVS, for the Jolly Boots. Oh, yeah, I went to three places today as I was doing laundry. I was busy. Um, they didn't have Jolly Boots. So um, I'm hoping the next, the, the, the liquor store down the street, you know, that they'll have some eggnog. But like I said, I'm stocked up. I'm good. I just don't want to run out. So I'm just like, so I'm on the hunt for that. And Felix is on the hunt for my hummingbirds. I bought another hummingbird feeder. Because I've had hummingbirds coming to my balcony, which is so awesome. There's two of them. There's one skinny one and one fat one. And I think there are a couple, but they fight. Like The, the fat one tries to bogart um, the feeder. And they first, I've had that on my balcony for such a long time. And I thought, I'm never going to get hummingbirds. And all of a sudden, I've been getting hummingbirds. And um, they drink that nectar so fast. I'm like, okay, I'm going to have to get another hummingbird station. Also, maybe that will stop them from fighting over it, but it doesn't. But um, I haven't got hummingbird houses. I went on Amazon and looked for little houses. So um, Felix is like, Mom, what are you doing? And um, what, what's funny is the hummingbirds don't care if there's a cat because good luck trying to catch it, Felix. I don't think it's going to happen. Like right now, the hummingbird is hovering, wanting the nectar, and Felix is right by the nectar. Oh, my God. Felix is right by the nectar. I Felix! Excuse me. Felix? Water. <laughs> I got him. Now the hummingbird's eating. Felix was like, there was the hummingbird feeder. Felix got on top and was just standing by the hummingbird feeder just like, go for it. Go for it. Taunting the hummingbirds. Ah, <sighs> nature. Animal kingdom at my house. Animal kingdom. Yeah, Felix, let the hummingbird eat. My lord. All right. I got to put all this stuff together and um, clean the house. And t today, Monday is always a big, big day for me. But anyway, I hope you had a great Thanksgiving. I'll let you know how it was next week. Because <laughs> I don't know if I'll buy anything next week. Because I'm going to be pretty much done except for maybe just cat food stuff so next week might be a little a light load at least i hope so all right to all my space cadets and all my cats i hope you have a good day until then